All right, well, let's hop over to some manga stuff here. Uh, we'll kick things off with manga sales, uh, continuing to track the um, uh, the weekly Shonen Magazine volumes we've been tracking, which has like Blue Lock, Ace of the Dawn Part 2, Fire Force, for examples. Uh, I believe this is going to be the last week, the final update for the August volumes that we've been tracking, which has like My Hero Academia Volume 31, Dr. Stone Volume uh, 22, Mashal Volume 7, just got a couple examples. But as a, once again, friendly reminder for like the third week in a row, we record on Thursdays. These updates have been dropping on Fridays. So with that said, here is a little bit of me going through the sales numbers right here. Hello. That time again, manga sells. Let's get into it. Weekly Shonen Magazine volumes. This is the second week for this bunch that we're tracking right now. This dated for 822. Blue Lock volume 15, 124K sold. Ace Diamond Part 2, volume 28, 123K sold. Fire Force, volume 30, 115K. Uh, Rent a Girlfriend, volume 22, 97K. Bakamano Guitari, volume 14, 70K. Shangri La Frontier, volume 5, 65K. Girlfriend, Girlfriend, volume 7, 57K. Smile Down the Runway, volume 22, 40 25k Sitokai Yukidomo volume 21 38k to your eternity volume 16 with 26k and my charms are wasted on Koroa Midaka volume 1 24k smarter and wiser than we were last week people that's all that matters let's keep on growing uh next up the final week that we're going to be tracking for these august volumes for weekly shonen jump we're about to jump into the september volumes now really exciting stuff there so this stated for 829 week four of this bunch coming at the top we got my hero academia volume 31 634k copies sold dr stone volume 22 229k copies sold mashal volume 740 45k copies sold. Elusive Samurai Volume 2, 88k copies sold. Kind of shocked that that didn't hit 100k like Volume 1 did. That one's kind of shocking. Uh, looking forward to see what Volume 3 will do. I believe that's in November. But yeah, kind of shocked that one didn't hit 100k. Uh, Blue Box Volume 1 was 65k. Of course, that one has had uh, some reprint issues. It's been had some out of stocks and stuff. So I would anticipate Volume 2 to be a lot better in sales for that one. Uh, let's look forward to that. Aikashi Triangle Volume 5, 66K. And lastly, Magi Chan Volume 5, Candy Flurry Volume 1, and Ball Parade Volume 2, all not ranked. Candy Flurry at this point is 1,000% on the chopping block between just the sales numbers and how the uh, the pacing of the latest chapters have been. But, uh, I mean, overall, pretty solid st uh, sales numbers. I did, you know, obviously notice, and I, as everyone did, that My Hero Academia uh, Volume 31, while selling 600K copies in a month is absolutely phenomenal. I definitely feel like it, it, it kind of staggered because it had such a hot start there for the first week or two where it hit 500K super quickly, and then it struggled to kind of get up from there uh, i was anticipating this to be a million a million uh, copy seller um which i believe volume 30 was i could be wrong um but that kind of staggered a little bit i mean still it's obviously a phenomenal number so can't can't walk that uh blue box I, I you know with 65k again out of stock issues reprint issues you know going on with that one so hopefully with volume two for blue box we're going to see some better sales numbers um then other than that i think that's about it so with that said back to the show oh, boom all right and we are back all right, so next little thing I want to give a shout out to is uh, we do have the announcement for what's coming out in November for Weekly Shonen Jump. Uh, we know that Dr. Stone, Volume 23, Sakamoto Days, Volume tw uh, Volume 4, High School Family, Volume 4, Elusive Samurai, Volume 3, Witch Watch, Volume 3, Red Hood, Volume 1, and Nero Volume 1. Very excited to see how Red Hood and Nero is going to do. Also kind of worried about it, too. I am worried about how Red Hood's going to do. You're hearing so many mixed things right now, but we, you know, we won't be able to find out till November on the sales unless they decide to just go ahead and kind of like ax it early or something. All right, uh, next up, let's go through what is the top five in Japan right now. This was dated for the 30th. Coming in at number one, Kaguya wants to tell you Genius Love Brain Battle, volume 23. What the hell is that? I do not know, but it was number one. Uh, Horse Daughter, Cinderella Gray, what the hell is that? I do not know. Volume four is number two. Black Lagoon, volume 12 is number three. Blue Lock, volume 15 is number four. And Oshi no Ko, volume five is number five. And I believe that was the one that won the it, it won an award that we just talked about last week or the week before. I think it was the week before we talked. I think that was the winner for an award category. Maybe the physical category. I think is what it was because it's part of uh, Young Young Jump, as I think is what it was. I think it's that series. And here's a fun fact. No Tokyo Revengers in the top 10, finally. This is the first time in weeks, for months, that there's no Tokyo Revengers. The first Tokyo Revengers volume on this list is actually at number 15. 
Uh, that's kind of baffling, but I guess everyone finally got their Tokyo Avengers volumes bought. So, uh, a couple things that we do have coming up. Uh, obviously, issue forty is dropping this Sunday. The cover will be One Piece. We got color pages for Magu Chan and the Food Wars Sanji edition. Uh, some notable things: the last four listed: uh, Nero, Icash Triangle, Red Hood, and Candy Flurry. So, shout out to that. It's, uh, we know Candy Flurry is pretty much on its last leg with how the series is, with where it's at currently from the latest chapter. Yeah, it's it's that uh, it's, it's getting axed. It's, it's dead. It's dead. Hundred percent. Um, with issue 41 coming out after that, the cover is on Dead Unluck. All right, that's pretty cool. Love to see that. We do have color pages for Black Clover, which, of course, come back from its unplanned break, Witch Watch, and High School Family that, you know, Kubo saved. So all, all good stuff there involving manga selves and what is to come. Uh, I guess with that, we can go ahead and hop over to our manga ratings for the week. I do want to say, just for the top five, the Kagu just wants to tell you, easier name than most people might know it by is Kagu Kaguya. Sama, love is war. I don't know. I still haven't heard of that. Still haven't heard of that. But yeah, you're right. That might be a more common name. Um, but no, I, I have no idea what that is. And I have no idea what horse daughter Cinderella Gray is. No clue. Mm-hmm. Hey, number one and two in Japan. So whatever. Um, <laughs> 